three, two, one. Merry Christmas, you filthy animals. and on this channel we talk about fragrances but today it is a very special Christmas episode we're in Poland with a fire in a fireside in a little Christmas kind of setting and we are me and my husband behind the camera we're going to show you what kind of fragrances we took away on this Christmas trip so first it's me I took two fragrances so first up is the one from Bayredo and it's not actually black saffron, I actually put another sample of Bayredo Slow Dance here inside and I've used pretty much all of it, I really like it, it's a very sweet, pleasant, cotton candy type of smell and it's very likeable, easy to wear, it doesn't have like a huge scent throw but it lasts a long time so I've been enjoying wearing it every single day. It's got my like everyday perfume. Next, I took away my favorite, I love the, I'm obsessed at the moment. It's Amaris Homme by Maison Francisco Cajan. This fragrance I took to wear on a bit of a special kind of um, time. So Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, I'm wearing this because this is a more of a special scent to me. It has got amazing long lasting power and it smells kind of like coconut and chocolate. So it's very cozy Christmassy. So we've got a little fireplace here, a Christmas tree and our beautiful little space. Em, what are you, what did you take with you? Let's go to the bathroom. Let's go to the bathroom. The shower room. So Show I, us what you got. Hello by the way, my name is Maxwell. <laughs> this is my husband. I'm uh, Monica's husband. I have uh, taken three perfumes. I think the light is better here maybe if I could just just remove myself from the toilet. I took, and this is probably one of my favorites at the moment, not maybe of all time, it's not overwhelming, so yeah, I like it very much. And Bloody I use Chanel. It. Bloody Chanel, and I use it a lot. As you often say, it's like a crowd pleaser, so mm -hmm. I know that most of the people will like it. Mm -hmm. This is like a safe option for me. Mm -hmm. um, I took this one because you actually, Monica, said that in, uh, in your review that this smells like a, a man fresh out of the shower. Mm -hmm. yeah. So actually I, I use this one in the mornings mm -hmm. uh, when I actually showered and I just... Very nice, I like this one a lot. It's so, great. Um, Aqua pour homme. Aqua pour homme. Uh, <laughs> so I use that in the mornings and this one I have taken uh, because of you Monica because I know just I just know that you love it mm -hmm. so much. Um, so I want you to, to have a yeah. Nice scent uh, on me with you. It's, let's see, Dior en Parfum. Very Dior nice. Dior en Parfum. But I am not the biggest fan of this one, uh, to be honest, Monica. Okay. It's, it's nice, obviously. It's not like, mm. Mm, I hate this perfume. No, it's, it's really nice. I like it, actually. I wear it. I'm wearing it at the moment. Ooh, that's extra. pretty. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's very generous. So good. So good. I'll link all the fragrances down in the description bar but now it's time for the comment of the day because if you didn't know I always read one of your comments from my previous video so if you press the subscribe button and notification bell and comment I will read your comment and today it's time for Piccolo Alberto's comment he said good stuff on the designer side by the way Merry Christmas to you and your husband thank you so much my designer's favorite at the moment is Guerlain Ambre Eternel which is a very nice fragrance thank you so much for commenting if you're interested in fragrances press that subscribe button I post every Monday and Friday and I'll see you in the next one bye